Good afternoon, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with random pack break number four, two-box random pack four of 2019 Panini Prism Draft Picks Football. You can see the break number right at the top of your screen right there. Very big thank you to these folks for getting into it. But first, we got to select which, uh, let's do some randomizing. Let's see which two boxes we're going to do. And that'll be the dice roll for all the lists. Three and a three, six times. Six the hard way. One, two, three. Four, five, and sixth and final time. After six times, we're going to do box three and ten. All right, so there's box three and ten right here. So let's pop these guys open and number the packs. Mark Madsen, you should be at number five. No, I don't have you in five. I do have you in five. Justin, Mark, Gabe, Dwayne, and EA. I don't know why. It, I don't know why I, my 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 brain didn't see your name. Could be the concussions, Mark Madsen. Could be the series of concussions I have from the case breaking world. It's a dangerous sport. I'll try not to, Mark. Yeah, gosh, it's Friday already, though. We made it. All right, now... Three and a three, six times for your names and the pack numbers. Six the hard way. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, so then we got Rich down to Mark. And once again, three and a three, six times for the pack numbers. One, two, Three, four, five, and six. After six times, we got four down to three. All right, so Rich, last spot mojo, four. Jason with seven, Curtis with two, Garrett with six, Ben with eight, Colton with nine, Garrett with five, David with one, Rich with ten, and Mark with three. Let's alphabetize by our first names. We'll be breaking by first name as well. Let me print out the labels for this and then we'll get the break started. No trades. All right, good luck, boys and girls. Schedule's in the chat, so keep an eye on that. Ooh, Mark, you got spring break, nice. There you go, you can just kick back and relax. Colton caught up with our vids and, oh yeah, the Tony Door set, nice. Congrats. All right, and maybe we'll pull you something nice in this break too, Colton. Ben Thompson, you are first. With pack eight. We haven't seen this guy yet. We have not seen Kyler Murray yet or Nick Bosa or any of the other bigger names. There's green Tom Brady and there's Caleb Wilson behind him. That green Tom Brady's not out of five, is it? Is it? It is! Five out of five, green Tom Brady in his Michigan gear. Woo! Ooh. Ben Thompson with pack eight. 
That is hot. Where did they get this action shot? I thought he never played. <laughs> ben Thompson all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop whoop. Yeah, I don't know what that goes for. It, it'll definitely cover the cover the spot, that's for sure. All right, next, Colton, pack nine. Rich is thinking 250 bucks. Is it a recolored Patriots picture? There's Nick Bosa to 99. Tyreek Hill and Gardner Minshew, the second. That means there's a first, too. Does that mean he has to name his kid Gardner Minshew, the third? There you go, Colton, pack nine. And just FYI, these purple and orange ones aren't numbered, but obviously they, they are going to ship. Let me sleeve these up really quick. Then we'll move on to Curtis with pack two. You're up to bat. David Lopez on deck and Garrett, you are in the hole. Whenever I talk about printing out labels, this is what I'm talking about. If you get hits, you know what I'm talking about, too. <laughs> if you get hits. Curtis, pack two. And there's Jake Browning. Green Jake Browning from the University of Washington. And the second train whistle out of this box. Four out of five. I guess there's two boxes. But I guess that's one box and that's another box. So train whistle per box. Nice. So the Jake Browning going to Curtis Gardner. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop whoop. All right, next up, David Lopez. Dave, here is pack one for you. Nice. Bucky Badger, that's his name, Bucky Badger. And Juan Thornhill. Juan Thornhill from Virginia. There you go, Dave. Are we building this mascot set, folks? Should we build this mascot set? We've seen a lot of these guys. 33 out of 49, old Bucky Badger. Is Bucky Badger, is Bucky Badger the the cutest mascot, quote unquote? Is the Oregon Duck. It's pretty cute too. What's the weirdest thing? The, the, the Ohio State Buckeye definitely looks weird, right? It's like a, it's like a, what's a Buckeye? It's like a nut on top of his head. Everybody knows 
Rex trying to waste my time as usual. Six and five for Garrett. Good luck, Garrett. William L. in the house. <laughs> William, you like the Stanford tree? Wait, I thought Buckeyes were, were... It's a candy, Rich? I thought Buckeyes were poisonous. I guess you could... I think you can boil the poison out of it, I guess. <laughs> well, I didn't want you to waste someone else's time for someone who didn't know your, uh, your sense of humor, Rex. There's Tom Brady and there's Montez Sweat. I'm trying to run a quick and efficient show. Wait, who's Otto the Orange? Is that an Otter Pop, Paul Hutchins? I don't know about this guy. This guy's pretty hilarious. Old Sparty. There he is. There's your autograph. There's Chase Winovich. Wino? Nice. That might be my new favorite autograph. Maybe a, a Cabernet Sauvignon kind of guy, maybe. Maybe a nice Merlot. A Syrah. A Malbec, perhaps. What kind of wino is he? I don't know. Maybe Two Buck Chuck from Trader Joe's. 41 out of 99. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe just like Charles Schaff from Trader Joe's. $2. That's what he's into. Who knows? I hope he, I hope he gets drafted and I hope that he's in a lot of products and I hope he keeps signing like that. Why no? Uh, no, not yet, Mr. X. That is coming up. We got this break, break four. Then we got five. Then we're doing Hit Parade 1 and 2 back to back. Then Prism 6. Then I got to go through a ton of orders. And then we'll, I'm sure we'll do another break. All right. Jason... Keen, Jason, with pack seven. Good luck. Maybe lucky seven? Yeah, it, it was uh, it's a Friday night. It looked like people got paid, Rex. And then they paid their bills, and they're like, all right, maybe a little bit of our disposable income can go to Jaspies. I'm sure that's what they were thinking. We got Jace Sternberger. Camo Refractor, Jace Sternberger for Jason Keen. I heard some good... Uh, some good thoughts, good, some good talk about this guy right here. We're not 25, so maybe this guy will turn out to be a player. All right, almost there. Stay on target, Mark Passmore. Pack three, and the last, these last two, 10-4 for Rich. Rich is on deck. Nittany Lion. That looks more like a, more like a, like footy pajamas instead of an actual mascot, right? There's John Elway and Travis Fulgham. To 99 from Old Dominion. We're your mascot show of record, ladies and gentlemen. What does Auto Orange look like, Paul Hutchins? From Syracuse? Is he just a big orange? An orange man? <laughs> Some sort of gender neutral orange? It is 2019. All right, Mark, there you go. And these last two are for you 10 and 4. 10 4.
Rich saying, Kyler Murray, please. We haven't seen him yet. There's 0% body fat DK Metcalf. There you go. That's, that's, a, that, that's what you kind of envision. I don't know. That nitty line looked a little weird. What about Big Al? Do we like Big Al? I feel like his trunk shouldn't be so droopy. There's Hakeem Butler. A buddy of mine went to Georgia, and he was the he was the Georgia Bulldog. He was Harry Dog for a couple of years. Benny Snell Jr. No relation to Blake, or maybe a relation to Blake. There's Ezekiel Elliott and Jordan Scarlet Letter. There it is. Hawthorne. All right, there you go, folks. There you go, Rich. No Kyler Murray in here, ladies and gentlemen, but. Maybe, just like in Super Mario Brothers, a princess is in another castle. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you next time for the next break, jazbeescasebreaks.com.